everyone, it's me again, Ronely Morelos from San Jose National High School. And welcome to the Petower Teleturuan. Before we start, let's take a look at these two pictures. Based on their facial expressions, picture number one shows what? Yes, the baby ate a sour food. How about this picture? Okay, the baby ate a sweet food. Now, I have a mystery word here. I would like you to rearrange the jumbled letters to get or to know the mystery word. So, are you ready? Okay, guess this mystery word. And our mystery word is... Yes, it's substitute. Now, in practical lives, is there any situation where you need a substitute? Or can you tell us any past scenario in your lives when you need a substitute? Yes, if we don't have the other hand, we will use tawas, correct? And if we don't have toothpaste, we can use what? Very good! We can use salt. Another practical example is in school. If a teacher is absent, do you think Manong Guard can take over his class? Okay, absolutely not. Why? Because who is absent again? The teacher. So the one who has the capability to take over a class is another teacher. Very good. Okay, based on our given practical examples, what is now a substitute? Exactly. Substitute means equivalent, replacement, or alternative. Now, in our kitchen, when we are cooking, sometimes some ingredients that you needed are not available. What do you do? Yes, you look for a substitute for a missing ingredient. Okay, let's find out how far you know in substituting ingredients. I will show you some ingredients. And let's say you need these ingredients but they are not available in your kitchen. You will now guess the possible substitute for the following ingredients. Are you ready? Okay, ingredient number one. That is butter. What is the best substitute for butter? Yes, correct. Margarine. Now, ingredient number two. Cornstarch. When cornstarch is not available, what would you use? Yes, of course, we will use flour. Ingredient number three, lemon. And this is not available. What do you think is the substitute? Okay, correct. You will use vinegar. Another ingredient is honey. Can you also guess the substitute for honey? Wow, you are really great. Honey is not available. We can make sugar and warm water. Now, please take a look at these two pictures. What do you observe? Can you see any difference? Wow, excellent. They both have substitutes. But... This one on my side, the exact weight or the amount of ingredients is included. Now, what does it imply? Yes, very good. So that means when we are giving substitute our ingredients, we need to consider some factors. And the number one factor is the flavor. When we say flavor, we are referring to Yes, the taste. For example, we need lemon in cooking with steak. And as we know, lemon has a sour taste. Can we use apple juice to substitute? 
No. Why? Yes, correct. We will use apple. If we will use apple juice, our beef steak will not taste as good as real beef steak, right? Yes. So we prefer vinegar as a substitute for lemon. The number two factor is the moisture. And moisture is one of the properties of water in a food. Now, before we continue to discuss the next factors, we will have first a short break. 